Djokovic, gorilla mindset. The hair's a little messy, doing a little traveling. Got the wife in the back, got the baby in the back. Some breaking news hit though, so we gotta report it live. This is real news, reality journalism. Nobody else is doing anything like this. So, big, big, big news today. For those of you who don't know, my Patreon backers and I, hey, Baked Alaska, messaging me. Guys, check my timeline before you ask me to retweet your stuff. More often than not, I've already retweeted it. All right, so we got a big, 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 big development. So I have a Patreon. I have a Patreon. So some of you know, some of you don't. So I have a Patreon, and I crowdfund journalism, but I don't keep the money. That's what a lot of people don't know about my Patreon. I live off of my book royalties and everything else, so the Patreon I use to fund journalism. So I, I talked to my Patreon backers, and I said, hey, there's this lawsuit involving Jeffrey Epstein and an accused... Um, okay, just make sure your boob's not hanging out. Okay. Sorry, there's breastfeeding going on. You know, I'm making sure it's safe for work. Got to keep it family friendly. You know, there's diapers changing, breastfeeding happening, j journalism breaking. That's just my life, guys. This, this is my life, man. <laughs> Whatever. So I, I, I asked my Patreon people, I said, hey, there's this lawsuit involving one of Jeffrey Epstein's alleged madams, an accused pedophile, right? Justine Maxwell, British socialite, Jeffrey Epstein, you know. So I go, can I use the money you've been giving me to pay a lawyer who's going to take a 50% reduced rate, very top lawyer. I only hire the best lawyers. And, you know, Mark Rendaza said he would do the case at a 50% rate of usual. So I said to my patrons, I go, hey, if I do, can I take this money and hire a lawyer and file? It's not technically a lawsuit. It's actually called a motion to intervene and then a motion to unseal records, right? So I, so I call it a lawsuit because on Twitter, Cernovich files motion to intervene and motion to unseal records, right? <laughs> Whatever. I paid a lawyer 25 grand, you know, to, to unseal records. So we're just calling it a, we're calling it a lawyer, lawsuit, right? So we filed a suit, motion to intervene and motion to unseal. The judge yesterday denied our motion to unseal the record. So everything is being filed under seal. So what happened today? Well, what happened today is the cavalry came in. Uh, New York Daily News and the New York Post are now going to sue to open up these records. So they hired Davis Wright Tremaine, which is another really very top lawsuit, very expensive, very great lawyers, top people too. So now the New York Daily News and the New York Post are joining my efforts to unseal these records to find out what's going on with these pedophiles, man. You know, that's what we'll do, dude. We'll just, we'll spend our own money and we'll crowdfund it because we want to know the truth and I want to bring you real journalism. So here's, so here's the current case status. The... I'm an intervener, so my lawsuit was granted. I've been allowed to intervene in the case. They denied the motion to unseal the records. Now the New York Daily News and hey, hey, hey. the New York Post have now hired a big law firm to say, no, 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 you should not have denied Cernovich's motion to, to unseal records. This is a First Amendment issue. This is currently the biggest First Amendment um, lawsuit of the year by far. So the, right now the biggest First Amendment lawsuit of the year was filed by me and my Patreons, my crowdsourced people. You can't deny it now. We want to find the truth. Real journalism. New York Times, Washington Post, where were they? Right? Where were they? While well, there's sealed proceedings in a civil court. You can't do that, right? Politico, to their credit, wrote about the story. So when I was in D.C., I met with a couple um, journalists from Politico, and they wrote an, an article that's actually a real news article. It's not, it's not a lie at all. It's actually a truth. And I linked to that on my Twitter, so Politico is writing about it. And we're, and we're trying to get attention to it. You know, we're, bake, we're making big moves. So that's where it stands right now. This is, though, a huge development. This is really big now because the judge might think, hey, because the judge is like 94, so the judge doesn't really understand people like me are the future of the media. The judge is thinking, oh, you know, who's this Cernovich guy? He's probably a nobody. I'll just blow him off and not listen to him or whatever. You know, he doesn't doesn't understand really, really anything, but that's just the way it is. And well, that's fine. But the New York Post and the New York Daily Mail, that's a little bit harder to ignore. So if you want to fund this journalism, which you can do, 
you can go to paypal.me forward slash Cernovich. paypal.me forward slash Cernovich. You can also go to patreon.com forward slash Mike Cernovich. patreon.com forward slash Mike Cernovich. And you can fund journalism that way. And as my Patreon people, we're going to have a call actually with my Patreons tomorrow. So it's a big, big thing, big thing going on. Now, what else? People go, Mike, you're a lawyer. Why didn't you file your own lawsuit? Guys, you know the number one rule of being a lawyer? What, Shauna, what's the number one rule of being a lawyer? Not being a lawyer for Say it so everybody can hear you so they know how smart you are. Don't be a lawyer for yourself. Never be your own lawyer. Baby, can you help me really quick? Can you yeah. grab this bag behind my seat? Yeah, hold on. Hey, guys, I got to flip this over real quick. I'll be right back. All right, what do I need to grab? Let's grab this bag so I can throw the food diaper in. Right here? Yeah. Right. Right. I'm going to get 20. Yeah, that's fine. All right, so I'll just zip it up, right? Um, no, not yet, because I have to put my phone. Oh, okay, okay, cool. All right, so there, I told you, reality journalism, we got diapers changing going on. <laughs> <laughs> what a world, right, guys? TMI, you're blocked. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? This is just this is reality journalism. Yeah, exactly. This is the real world, man. The real world is that I'm always working all the time, being dad, husband, all that stuff. That's just the real real world of journalism. And if you can't handle that, babies, you know, they poop. Breaking news. Babies poop. Breaking news, my god, TMI. You know, who who knew? Who knew that babies poop? Nobody knows. That's why you come to Cernovich Media, because that's where you get, that's where you get the breaking news. But honestly, that's why I tell people this literally is my life. Um, right now, we're you know, Sean is driving because I'm typing. Literally, we're driving. We're gonna go to a wedding. Sean is driving, and I'm in the back seat, hanging out with my daughter, typing up, doing journalism, working with sources. I'm on Signal, talking to people, talking to sources. Breaking news in real time. Well, hey, that's just life, dude. That's reality news. I don't, I don't have a billion dollar budget, right? I'm not the New York Times. I'm not owned by other people the way all these other outlets are. The people are who support me and prop it up, and that's just the way it is. And I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm not complaining. I love it. I love connecting directly with the people who read my stories. It's a, it's amazing, right? So I'm not complaining, but I'm just saying like that's the reality. The reality is we had to take a pit stop. While, I, while I'm writing a story up, we had to take a pit stop because Syra, you know, did what babies do. And that's just life, man. The real world reality news. So, yeah, if you want to fund our journalistic endeavors, then you can do you can do PayPal. You can just PayPal me, paypal.me forward slash Cernovich. And you can go to patreon.com forward slash Mike Cernovich. And like I said, the money doesn't go to me. If you want to give me money directly, go buy a hundred of my books, paperbacks, donate them to... Yeah, what's up? Isn't that how you got this really good Berkeley? Yeah, exactly. Patreon also is funding people who are doing journalism to cover Berkeley. So that's where the money goes, is if, if you know, why are there so many great live streams of these events in Berkeley? Because we pay people through the Patreon to go up there and do that. We cover their travel and everything. So we're sending people all over the world, and we have more planned. We're definitely expanding. Hey, hey, careful, um, So you're blocked. Um, haters. And we want to send people to South Africa, a lot of things. So if you want to give me money, go buy 100 copies, paperback, a gorilla mindset, and donate them to libraries. Because I spend the book royalties. Book royalties, I live off of. The Patreon, that's what we do to fund journalism. It's what we do to fund these lawsuits against pedophiles and everything. Anyhow... Anyhow, that's really cool. Big development. We are going to find the truth about these pedophiles. So lawsuits. Well, that's what we're doing. That's what people don't understand about the new right and new media. What people just don't really get. We're not the na the National Review and know, Weekly Standard. They're not filing lawsuits like this. And they have massive budgets. <laughs> oh, what's up, June? She's going to end up like, buckling up her when she starts crying. Yeah, we all these people, these big budgets, Young America's Foundation, they're not doing anything. None of these conservative, well, Judicial Watch is doing great work. So I don't want to say nobody. Judicial Watch is right now at the top of its game in terms of more conservative things or whatever. Right now, Judicial Watch is killing the game. They are playing at an A level. They 
So, yeah, I'm not shading everybody. I'm shading people who deserve it. Weekly Standard, National Review, Young America's Foundation. Those are all scams, money laundering operations that do nothing. All right. Judicial Watch is killing it. That's what we were doing. Killing it. God, I got nothing but praise for Judicial Watch, for sure. James O'Keefe is doing great work, too. The traditional media, though, they're not doing what needs to be done. They don't have the political will to do what they have to do. But that's why we